Hi everyone, it's Debbie. Welcome to my channel or welcome back. If you're new here, I'm a reseller. I've been reselling for 17 and a half years and I absolutely love it. And today is inventory giveaway day. If you're new to this channel, I have a tradition that on the 15th of every month, I have some type of inventory giveaway just to tell all of you, thank you so much. You guys are all so wonderful. I appreciate you. So this is just my thank you to you guys every month. Normally what I do is I have one winner each month that is randomly chosen and I send a box of inventory that has a resale value of about three to $400. This month, I'm going to do it a little bit different. Instead of having one winner, we will have four winners, and I have several different types of inventory, which represents the different things that I sell. I'm going to have a men's box. I'm going to have a box with liquidation items. They're all new with tags. I will have a box of swimsuits that are new or new with tags. And then I will have a box of women's clothing, which are mainly pre-owned from the bins. I think one item is from a regular Goodwill store. And then there are a couple of retail arbitrage new with tags items also. So I'm going to have these available on different platforms. So after I tell you about each box, tell you which platform they are on and what to do if you want to win that box, but only one box per person. As we go over each item, I will have a pop-up on this side that tells you what I think the resale value at the minimum is for that item based on sold comps. I will then have a running total for that box. I will put where I source that item from, how much it cost, and what the running total is for the cost of that box, and then any other little notes at the bottom. So even if you don't win one of the boxes this month, I'm trying to provide information that will provide value for you when sourcing and reselling. And I will be going over a lot of sold comps and trying to put information in that will be helpful. So we will start out with the men's box. And this one is going to be available on Poshmark. I will show you what is inside. The first item is a pair of men's Nike shorts and these sell great. They are Nike Golf. They are a nice gray color and they are a size 42. And they have the little swoosh on the back and they're in excellent condition. I think these should sell for around 20 or $22. Then a pair of tan men's Polo Ralph Lauren shorts. These are the Prospect Short 100% cotton flat front. They are size they are size 38, so that's a good size. They're in excellent condition, and these should sell for... Well, let's see. There were so many sold comps for Polo Ralph Lauren Prospect Shorts, so I narrowed it down even by size 38. I put in tan, and there were quite a few. And on Poshmark, sometimes there can be some super low comps. I kind of throw those out and look at what the majority of them show, kind of upper, middle, range and I think these should sell for anywhere between $20 and $25. So we are just going to count $20. I think they should easily be able to sell for $20. And the great news is that the sell-through rate is excellent. There are so many more that have sold than are asking. I have found that Polo, Ralph Lauren shorts usually do really well. Then another pair of men's shorts. So I, I try to make sure everything was good for the season also. These are another pair of men's shorts and these are P, D, and C paper, denim, and cloth. And these are just a nice lightweight summer short and they are a size 34, 100% cotton. And I just looked up comps on these. I think these should sell for around $18. Then we have a pair of men's denim shorts from The Buckle, BKE. I love selling BKE from The Buckle and I did not find the size on them when I looked quickly, but on men's shorts, it's really easy. Men's shop by waist size. So I just measure them. They measured 17 inches straight across. So there are 34 waist. So when I, when I list them, the waist measures 34 and that's usually no problem with men's shorts. 
This is why I love selling BKE men's shorts and jeans. Let's look up sold comps. If we first look up men's jean shorts, BKE, and we wanna see what is available, I quickly scroll through to get an idea of how many are out there. I wish like eBay, Poshmark showed the exact number, but you can just kind of scroll through and get a general idea. And there are a few pages of them. Now we will keep all of the same search criteria except we will change the field from available to sold. And wow, I scrolled and scrolled and scrolled. I did not come to an end. I finally just stopped looking because I knew it was clear that there were far more that had sold than are currently listed. So I know that is an excellent sell-through rate. I can price mine at the upper end and I can expect it to sell quickly. So this is absolutely what you want to look for when sourcing items and the reason why I chose to put this pair of shorts in the box. And then a polo Ralph Lauren t-shirt, green with an orange pony on the chest. And this is custom fit. You wanna be sure and say custom fit on the listing because it's a more athletic fit. And usually the custom fit shirts do better for me than the classic fit. And you know, this one's probably only $10, but it is in excellent, excellent condition. I was a little surprised when I looked up sold comps on this one. They were a little bit higher than I thought they were, but I'm still just going to put a value of $10 because I would rather aim low and have it sell for more for the winner than to inflate the amounts that I think it can sell for. But I do feel like it's a little bit higher value due to being that custom fit, but that's why it always pays to look up comps. Even if you've sold them so many times, you want to see what the current comps are because things are always changing and the comps looked good for this one. So if you win this, aim a little higher. I think you can do a lot better than $10. And then the best thing out of this box, I kind of wanted to keep this. This is probably one of my favorite brands to find right now because the sell-through rate is crazy good. This is Travis Matthew and it has the logo on the back and these are a super lightweight summer type pant and they are, let me see what size they are. They are a size 34. And I had a shirt today. I sold a polo shirt to, just today that was Travis Matthew. And it even had a logo for a country club oak tree in Oklahoma City that is not like a super sought after. And it sold very quickly. So this is a great brand. Everything that I get in it sells very, very quickly. I think these should sell quickly for about $35. Okay, so this box is going to be available on Poshmark and I want it to be completely free. So I'm going to put $10 inside the box. So the first person that goes to Poshmark, it will be in my Shop Girl 242 closet. So the first person that sends me a $3 offer, you can send a $3 offer first and then send a message to me and say that you found me from YouTube. You've let me know your YouTube username. And if I get that message from you and you were the first person to send the $3 offer, I will accept and I will send it to you. If you send a $3 offer to me, it is going to end up costing like I looked it up and my last trade that was a $3 offer actually came to $10.73. So I will put $11 in the box, not 10, because I wanna be sure to cover it. And if it's gone up and if it's more than that, I will cover it. I will make sure that the winner does not have to pay anything. Okay, so that one is on Poshmark. The next one will be on eBay, and this is open for international buyers also because I know I have international buyers. I know Haley is in Canada, and I'm sure there are others in other countries also, so I wanted to provide one that had international shipping also. And since I talk about liquidation all the time, I thought I would give you some of my liquidation items. So the first item is two of the same thing because I love having multiple quantities. It makes it so much easier. I know for me, the key, the years that I have made a lot of money is when I had multi-quantity items. So the first thing, I have sold a lot of these. I've sold them on Poshmark, I sold them on eBay, Macari. I might have even sold one on Facebook Marketplace. 
I had a lot of these. I think I still have about 30 or 40 left, but they trickle out all the time. They're so cute. I kept one for myself and like it also. This is the Premonitions Bodycon Dress. Both of these are size small. You are welcome to go into my listing. You can use my information, anything that I have. I don't mind at all if you, if you win this. Feel free to use the information that I have on my listing. With these, you can probably get 20 to $25 on each of these. I thought I would take a moment and show you how I am cleaning up photos in some of my listings that I have had for about a year. And I thought I had to have something like a tree or cute in the background for Poshmark, but it ends up looking terrible and dark. So I just screenshot each of the photos. I do not retake my pictures. Then I use the app Photo Room and I do pay a monthly fee so that I can have the batch feature, which I love and it removes the background from multiple photos at one time. I save it to my camera roll, then I go back into my listing. I take out all the old photos that look terrible and I replace them with the new photos with the background removed and it just makes them look so much more professional and they just seem to light up more. And I want you to know I promote photo room all the time. I have never received one penny from them. I pay the, my subscription every month. I did have a link for a little while, but it never worked and I never got a commission, but that is okay. It is still one of my absolute favorite tools. I think it makes such a difference in the photographs. So I think that little bit of time, it took a minute and a half, is well worth it to make the listing look so much better. And the next thing I sell these all the time, again, multiple quantities, and I love how they come pre-packaged, and what I do is I just open up one, take a photograph of it, and then all the others are ready to go. So I probably still have about 30 of these. So I grabbed three of them. Two of them are size medium, one is size small. Easy. And these usually sell for around 10 to $12 for me. So this is 30, the $36 value right here. And then this one, I just shipped off one of these this morning and I have a lot of these too. So I thought I would share three of them. And this is one that was out of the package. So I thought I would grab this and show you. It's so pretty, I love the color. So just take one out, photograph it. And then let's see, size small. These are all three size small. So you'll just create one listing with a quantity of three. And these also sell for around 10 to $12. So six of these, so that's worth about anywhere between 60 and $72. And then these are 20 to $25 each, so another 40 to $50. So that's over a $100 value, and this would be, and this will be super easy and quick to list. So you can see how this will take very little work to be able to make money on this. So if you would like to win this one, just go to my eBay store, love to shop 242, go into the store and I will have a listing and I'll have this listed for some high amount. I will have this listing titled free people liquidation reseller lot. I will have it listed for something silly like $200. If you send me an offer for 99 cents, but don't pay for it, then send me a message and the same as the first one and tell me that you found me on YouTube and what your YouTube username is, then I will accept the 99 cents offer and I will mark it as paid. So just whoever sends the offer to me first. So you can send the offer first and then send the message if you'd like to. So that is the second one. That's going to be on eBay. So we have a Poshmark one, an eBay one, and let's do another Poshmark one. This one is going to be all women's clothes and we will start with...